The technology contained within the modern motor car can be both fascinating but slightly baffling nowadays as well. Most of such technology exists to make our cars safer, more efficient and just better than ever to drive. But some of it can be quite confusing for the average motorist. So in this A to Z series, we will attempt to unravel the mystery of technology that is the modern motor car. This week, the letter F. F is for fly-by-wire. Fly-by-wire technology was, as you can probably guess from the name, developed by the aircraft industry to help reduce the manual flight requirements of a pilot with a computer-controlled electronic system. In short, to allow a plane to fly itself. In vehicles, this technology is used to control the throttle, but also an increasing number of other elements within a car to a point where autonomous driving, where a car can drive itself, is already upon us. All Jaguar Land Rovers have fly-by-wire throttles, where simple electric signals detected via sensors on either the accelerator pedal or the cruise control switch on the steering wheel are translated into more or less power being deployed by the engine. Eventually, fly-by-wire technology will enable most cars to drive themselves in much the same way that most planes have been able to fly themselves for many years. F is for four-wheel drive. In one sense, the term four-wheel drive is entirely self-explanatory, but there are many different ways in which a vehicle can deploy its propulsion via all four wheels. And the first ever four-wheel drive system was developed by an English engineer called Brammer Joseph Diplock in 1893 and it was used to power a traction engine. Nowadays, vehicles can be part or full-time four-wheel drive, or pretty much anything in between. Most modern four-wheel drive systems use electronics to control the amount of torque that goes to each axle, or sometimes even to each wheel. But in previous four-wheel drive systems, this used to be controlled by hydraulics and clutches, and in the original Defender's case, via what was called a transfer box, that enabled a lower set of gear ratios to be called upon when climbing up especially steep hills. All modern Jaguar Land Rovers are available with four-wheel drive, with the Range Rover, the Discovery and the Evoque being some of the most capable examples both on and off-road anywhere in the world. F is for future technology. Electric vehicles, hybrid vehicles, hydrogen-powered vehicles, the use of increasingly exotic materials, some of which are hybrid themselves, and even vehicles that will eventually drive themselves. These are just a few of the technological elements to our motoring future that are being developed by the automotive industry today, but especially so at Jaguar Land Rover, the UK's biggest investor in the industry. Quite where it will all end up, and exactly what will all end up driving or merely travelling around in, who knows? But one thing is for sure, never has so much technology been applied to produce vehicles that are safer, faster, more efficient or more reliable than they are today. And tomorrow our cars will, be in no doubt, get better still. Next week, the letter G. <laughs> <laughs>